You probably like to make some changes to a house when you first moved in, right? Well, that's what the Baltimore Orioles are doing at Ed Smith Stadium right now. The team is very busy making sure the stadium is splashed with orange and black before they move in. SNN Local News 6 reporter Grant Boxleitner has more on the ballpark makeover. Looking around Ed Smith Stadium, there's still plenty of red from when the Reds called this place home. But the Baltimore Orioles have begun putting their own touches on the ballpark. Fans will soon see a total transformation. I've seen the blueprints of it, and it looks like it's going to be terrific, I think. The fans will love it. Local artist Dale Allward has been doing baseball artwork around Sarasota for nearly 30 years. Well, in the mid-'80s, I started painting for the uh, Chicago White Sox down at Payne Park, the park that the predecessor to this park. Allward also did work for the Reds at Ed Smith, but now his colors are black and orange. Really like their uh, their attitude and their their uh, cartoon bird. I let, it's a neat thing that they're letting me paint. In addition to painting over all this red, the Orioles also plan on switching out the retired numbers from the Cincinnati Reds with those of their own team. Crews from Pelican Painting have already lined orange on the clubhouse. Today they were preparing the dugouts for a fresh coat of paint and covering some other items in Camden Yards green. We're doing a lot of this this green and we're doing a lot of the orange. We're changing colors. It's a different team, different colors. Leaving no doubt for fans who's playing at Ed Smith Stadium. It looks good. It looks that different to the other color, the other team before. <laughs> Reporting in Sarasota, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News 6. And the Orioles are already selling spring training tickets from 10 to 4 daily at the Ed Smith box office. That's right off of 12th Street in Sarasota. Pitchers and catchers report for their first workout February 18th.